that loud, probably. Increase the pay and turn this down. Is this good? I think this is probably good. I never know with the audio. But I think this is good. Good. Drawing time. Start with hair. What is this hair color? Color picking's hard. <laughs> nope. Nope. Mm -hmm. Maybe. That looks pretty good. Probably zoom in so I don't miss spots. Are these close lines? I hope so. Ah. Oh, good. <laughs> everything uh clean it up hello peoples can i i just want to make sure people are able to chat because sometimes i think i have it so they can't which is not good I think it's fine now. Hello! Oh, chat does work. Hello! We draw on Ronbo. How are you? Is the audio okay? Is the music too loud? Can I be heard? <laughs> I think the audio should be all right. Let's see colors. Music's a bit quiet. Okay, I will turn it up a bit. Let me know if that's better. I think that should be better, right? Let me know. <laughs> uh, what are the colors of this person? It's better okie dokes. Sounds good. I don't know why I said okie dokes, but... Uh, let's do the shirt first. I'm gonna procrastinate the mask. I don't want it too blue. I always do bluish blacks instead of reddish blacks. But most of this image is red, so I'm gonna stick with the red. Um... 
This is my first drawing stream, I think. So hopefully it's not too boring. Because <laughs> I get very concentrated into what I'm doing a lot of the time. But I thought I would try. I forgot to draw the line here, so I'm just going to do it with color. That should be fine. I'm also very much procrastinating drawing the box around his head. Because I don't know how to do it yet. <laughs> I've seen the video that just got posted on the journal. I haven't seen it yet. Did he post it already? I didn't see it in my subscription box. I'm excited to watch it after this then. <laughs> Colors is oh gray. I'm gonna do a yellowy gray. Uh, yellowy gray is kind of ugly though. Was it a good video? It just came out at the same time that the stream started. <laughs> oh, I just missed it. That's a bummer. I was kind of waiting for it before I did this, but I decided to just go for it. I will definitely watch it after this, though. So. I'm really excited for the, uh, the, like, Founder's Cut version of it. That's gonna be really cool. Hello! Welcome. I'm gonna turn on the music for myself because it's real loud. Just a sec. Okay, that's better. Let me turn it up in OBS now. Uh, okay. Everything's fine now. <laughs> It was so loud in my head, I could barely think. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna leave the ropes for now. Ah. Oh, I'm drawing on the wrong layer. No. Hello? Player? Why is it not drawing? Mm. Am I selected onto nothing? Yes, okay. <laughs> eh, I'll try to get these ropes so I don't get confused. There we go. And then the red, right? Yeah. It's more of this shade of red, I think. A pinkish red, perhaps? No, I don't like the pinkish red. I feel like there's not enough contrast. With oh, that's too bright. Oh, maybe it's not too bright, actually, <laughs> looking at the actual picture. That's, uh, it's so saturated. I don't know how I feel about it. We'll see. Is this gonna be a short live? Um, I don't know. We'll see if I get tired or not. <laughs> I might go for a bit. I at least want to finish the general coloring of this. Of the guy. But 
Maybe I'll stream working on this again tomorrow. I don't know. Because I want to put um, all the other characters in the TV screens around. And I know that that'll take a long time. So I don't think I'll finish the drawing today. But that's the plan. You're gonna add shadows and stuff, right? Yeah, I will. I won't just do the flats. We'll do some shading. Hello! Welcome to stream. Oops. Wait a sec. Do I have to hand- Ah! Hand erase all that? Okay. I was being messy with this. I'll just do it by hand. Uh, I'm gonna do it for this, though. Make my life a little easier. Ah, uh, that looks pretty good. Pants time. What are his pants? Are they... They're denim, right? Like dark blue jeans? It's hard to tell in the lighting. I think it's denim. I don't like that color then, though. Is that about right? Hmm. I'm so picky about colors. I don't know why. That looks better. It is denim, right? Am I wrong? I think it is. That looks... And what are his shoes? Black? I always default to drawing Converse. <laughs> but I think he's just got black sneakers. And if they aren't, then they are now. Uh, I'll let the white after. Beiges and browns, off whites and grayscales, fluorescent lights to shine on the edge fairy ground. Now you're lying there we go, and then I'll let the white, blend into the but extremely off white. A little darker. Oh, the way you draw the hands. Thank you. I don't know what I'm doing with hands, so I appreciate that a lot. It always takes me extra long to draw hands in any given drawing. You can't tell, but in speed paints, I always edit out all the different iterations of the hands. Ear, 
these are kind of limpy looking hands, but. <laughs> uh, what color is the rope? Red? That makes sense. I'm gonna do a darker red. They look good, thank you. I'm glad. Oh, that's not the right. We don't need maroon ropes. They look like they're mixed with black, though. I haven't actually seen the gin last videos yet. Oh, uh, you're, you're getting a treat. They're so good. It started off different than I thought, but it's really good. Did I draw this in the wrong layer? No. Where did my rope go? Oh. <laughs> I'm kind of drawing. I don't know. Let's see if I can make time to watch them. Yeah, definitely. It's kind of long. I think he's um, putting out like an edited version on the Genlust channel. So it'll be like a movie link version if you don't have time to watch all the streams. You could wait for that to come out. I don't know when that is coming out, but... There's like ropes on the hands too that I didn't draw. Uh, that's kind of awkward. The mask is dark. Ah! You were just accidentally like a group instead of a layer. Oh, it's like a dark grayish black. just joined hello welcome we do be drawing so just realize your music choice well what is super talent right i love his music i think he's very underrated hello i did uh a video recently where i drew uh his album in case i make it as a little character design if you haven't seen it I'll do a quick self promo <laughs> But I thought it turned out pretty good. Their hair looks so floofy. It is. Honestly, I'm so jealous of their hair. It's so thick and nice looking. Arm's hair is stunning, right? Wish my hair could do that too. I know. If I could have Rambu's hair, I that would be great. They have such like thick hair. Mine's so flat, but that's okay. I didn't, hmm, I didn't draw the mouth, but remember I mentioned how he wants their pronouns used, like, interpret, um, I don't think he's ever said, I think he's just okay with he or they, in any which way. <laughs> I could be wrong though, but from what I understand, that's how I see, like, uh, his friends refer to him. Yeah.
Hmm, let's see. I should... Hmm. Let's do the eye whites first. I like to procrastinate hard parts. Actually, I'm gonna... Ah! Oh no. My Photoshop keeps doing this thing where it freezes and then I have to fully exit out of the drawing and then re-click it. So, give me a sec. The background's awesome. I always struggle with that. Ugh, backgrounds are hard. I, like, usually avoid doing them, but I had a clear reference for this one with the actual screenshots, so it's a little easier when you've got a reference. Uh, I was going to tool drop the whites from the shoes for the eyes so that all the colors are more cohesive. Up we go. Oh, that's way darker than I thought. Uh, maybe a little bit lighter. There we go. Let me save. Okay, next. Let's do the blood under the mask, I think. And then do the wires on top. I think that's the game plan. It looks nice, thank you! I start- oh, whoa. I started it today. While, uh, Rambu did the stream talking about it. So I gotta go have a great rest of the stream. Thank you! Thank you for stopping by! I appreciate it. change this is the blood all the way up there I feel like any more skin <laughs> to be seen I haven't needed to draw blood in a long time. Is that looking all right? I think once the wires are on top, it'll look good. What are the wire colors? Yellows and blues, mostly. I'm gonna leave this reference up. <laughs> and then blue. Looks like there's some red wire, but... I might add some bonus wires for artistic purposes. <laughs> or maybe not. Who's to say? If I can get it to look good. the edges. Does that look good? I think that looks fine. Uh, 
I may have made the gap in the mask a little big, but it's fine. Oops, wrong reference. The red here. Uh, it's all right. No, that's not right. It's like this weird 3D shape. There. There we go. I wish the blood was more noticeable. I think it's all right though. I'm going to merge all these layers now. And then do shading. Oh wait, I forgot the detail on the jacket. Hang on a minute. White. Two stripes. Me redrawing the same line over and over again. <laughs> Is it the same on the sleeves? Hard to tell when there's ropes around them. Well, there is at the bottom, so. I'm gonna put a stripe on the sleeve anyway. down here there we go I might do two on the sleeves actually I think that looks better. I'm sure it would inspire you to make those fantastic arts this specific piece? I just watched the show and then I got inspired. <laughs> or do you mean like art in general or like a specific piece? For this one, I just watched Generation Loss and I thought it was cool. No all? Oh, making art in general? Um, I don't know, I've been doing it since I was a kid. So it just kind of naturally happened. I think a lot of it is just like, I'm a fan of things and I want to show my appreciation for things. Or like, express my love of something. And my go-to way to do that is drawing. <laughs> so a lot of my art is just fan art. Uh, merge this down. Now shading time. Hmm, the shading's kind of hot. Do I do the box first, maybe? So I can get the right the lighting more right? I should probably do the box. I 
Okay, now I watch this for a bit. I beg your pardon. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Uh, what color is this box? Grayish, greenish, yellowy color. Mm, a little warmer. Little, hmm, the colors are so hard. I'm gonna do this for now. <laughs> How big is this box? Is the next question. That seems good. Right? My sketch of the box is too small. It's really big though. Hmm, maybe it's not. I would like it a little bit perspectived. That do be a box. It looks way bigger than I thought it would. And I don't know how I feel about that. Is there a top to the box? I'm gonna merge these. There's like... Hmm. Confused. Confused about perspective. Let's- oh, I did that on the wrong layer. Whoops. And then it bends back this way. And then we can- Move that over here. Okay. Box, right? Hmm. This is tricky. Drawing 3D objects. <laughs> I don't. I'm so confused. Part of it, I think I just gotta go for it. Oops, wrong way. perfect but I would like it to be close <laughs> I 
Does that look like a... It's becoming a box. I think that's becoming a box. Maybe I'll just do one box at a time. Um, and then... Hello, how's the stream going? It's going pretty good. I'm struggling to draw a box right now, but... You know how it is. We all struggle with boxes every once in a while. It's like open at the bottom, I think. I am very genuinely confused. Blew me two hours ago. <laughs> Were you drawing a box two hours ago? It is a struggle. It's shading. Yep, I hate that part. It's so confusing. Like, it looks so cool, but how do I draw it? It's like, I'm not looking forward to adding the spikes, that's for sure. I'm gonna do some like blending shading for the box. Mostly because I'm too lazy to be neat about it. What's next with this box? There's like, it's even harsher. Here, at the top. But I feel like that doesn't make, that looks weird. But what if I'm wrong and that's just how it looks? More silence for Nikki. Oh, Nikki. Yes. That was quite sad. I'm gonna draw Nikki in one of these TVs. Just don't know which one. She'll get her tribute. isn't quite boxing. Okay, there's like a yellowy light source. That's true, heavy pulling for Nikki, I know. Her acting was so good too. The crying. I'm getting real quiet because I'm very concentrated on making this shading but I think it's the wrong color eraser this whole box is the wrong color isn't it the way I did it Hmm. 
I wonder that there's dried up blood on the box as well as... Maybe this is... Oh, yo! I didn't even notice that! There's... Oh my god, what is my computer doing? There's dried up blood in it? Or is it rust? Oh wait, no, there is! Oh... Yikes. Why does it keep my computer being weird? Um, yeah, I'll definitely add that in. Why are you mad at my flash disk thing, computer? Okay, um, <laughs> that's really cool detail. Why is my computer mad at me? I'm gonna save this. Oh, is my com- Hmm... <laughs> is my computer... Full, like the memory. I can't even save it. Those are full. Okay, give me a second. <laughs> uh... Uh... Hang on a second. I gotta go th delete things, I think. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> How did it get so full? My memory wasn't that bad when I started this. I know what I can delete. Yeah, I've got a lot I can delete. I've got a ton of old footage I can delete. Recycle bin. Okay, I think everything should be fine now. Yippee! I fixed it. Everything's fine. With the computer with the storage at this point of everyone's so true. I fixed it now. Where? Okay. I don't like the colors I've got going, and I need to fix it. I feel like there's a greenish tinge to it, but ew. <laughs> um. That doesn't look good. Oh, maybe that looks good. Yeah, that looks way better. Okay. I don't like it, though. But I suppose the green colors will add contrast to how everything's red and draw the attention to his face, which is the goal. So, I will accept it. It's all I will take for me or to post a video for MatPat. Oh, I was literally thinking that, like, earlier. I was like, when's the MatPat video gonna happen? <laughs> It'll be good. So shadow works IRL kinda? Yeah. I don't like IRL shadows. <laughs> I get confused by them. I'm not under- I'm still not understanding this box. I'm having so much confusion. What are- what are you, Ronvu? What is this box and why did you make it? To hurt the artists. It's, uh... Hmm. 
There's like light coming in from the side here. That is also confusing me. Okay, I think something that will help. Uh, is drawing the bottom of the box that would probably help geometry so true I remember in art class when I was a kid I was like it was like grade 6 I was like 11 or 12 I was like really good at all the projects and the teacher would always praise me but then there was a project involving geometry like an art project and my teacher got real mad at me for rushing it cause, and having it turn out bad. Because I didn't understand how to draw geometric shapes. I just got here wanted to say this looks awesome so far. Ah, oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I need a thicker pen. I don't know what I'm doing. I think drawing the bottom of this box will help though. Why is my pen size not being shown? Oh, there we go. <laughs> It doesn't need to be perfect, right? Oh, yikes. Um, hmm. That sure looks like... See, this is why I did bad on that project. I think the more I stretch it, the straighter the line will look. box has one does it not i can't tell let me see that would make sense so that it doesn't actually chop his head off irl but then like i see this line but i don't know I kind of think you're right, and it doesn't have a bottom. And I think maybe it's just the... There's like a... A thing here. It doesn't, I got a good pic of it when they were streaming earlier. Oh. Okay. There's a square around his neck that makes up the bottom. Uh, yeah, that's true. This box gets more and more confusing. I did not expect it to be. I thought the hardest part of this drawing would be background, not box. But I think there's like a. Does that look like something? I feel like that adds depth, if anything. Which can't hurt. And there's like a flappy deal over here. Isn't there? That sticks out more? Or that's just three to hang on. Okay, I think I understand a part of my problem. I think. Wait. No, I got confused again. <laughs> hang on, hang on. I can figure this out. Okay. Okay. This part needs to be bigger and stick out more, right? I think.
Like this sort of thing? Does that make sense? And then, like, the spikes come off the side of that? Uh, angle this different. Yeah. Oh, didn't mean to zoom in. But then, bigger, bigger. Uh, it's certainly looking like something. I don't want to say it too much, I guess. And then we can do, we can do... Make it look a little more 3D. Where's that coming from? There we go. Right, maybe? Be like a, a little bit of a light there, like a rim light. I think that'd be on top though. Where's the on top? There we go. I don't really, really do rendering like this usually. Mayhaps that's... I feel like it looks alright in the viewfinder. Viewfinder? Is that what this is? The navigator? From afar? Yeah. That looks alright. Gonna save it. Spikes will definitely help make it look like the box. picture yeah this is what it's gonna gonna be gotta add a lot of stuff still have to add the ropes on the hands here and then all the faces in the tv and i might put the logo up there don't know yet or not the logo the like title screen is that what it's called I guess I should start adding the spikes. Where's the layer that I need? Okay. Mm, I don't think I need this. But I'm gonna keep it anyway. Because I like it. Very subtle. Okay, okay. Spike time, spike time. Look at the spikes again. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna. I've got a reference on my other monitor. <laughs> it's a very tiny reference, so I can barely see it. Um. Hello. Wait, why is it? Why is it not even showing up? Oh, because I've got it clipped onto the wrong thing. Ah, now I've just got a bunch of lines. Okay. <laughs> um. Whoops. Whoops. What am I doing? Making a mess. Okay. Here we go. I'm worried. I guess I'll start. Oh, 
And then I'll shade the spike individually. Make it sharper. Sharp enough to impale. Um. Is it at the right angle though? Who's to say? Oops. And then there's like a lighter bit on the top. Like so. Trying to blend it. I mean, that definitely looks like a spike. So I'll take that. I'm just gonna take them. Is that too... What are the spacings? Oh, the spacings are weird. Okay. <laughs> Middle one goes up a bit. These ones go down a bit. a bit smaller. And then... Oh no, no, it doesn't read. I'm being picky. I can just put spikes and people will get the gist. Probably fine. Well, let me merge all those because now I just got a bunch of rando spikes loose. And then we do shade shadows at the bottom. Like, hang on, let me look at it again. Yeah, okay. Like, there's like shadows like this. That'll diffuse it with the eraser. This is why I don't do backgrounds very often. I just kind of draw people floating there usually. <laughs> Eraser, but it's good practice, I suppose. Fair and save, yeah. It's fun to draw people, but then putting them somewhere is a difficult task. Okay, that looks like a box to me. I'm going to do the sideways spikes now. Am 
many can be seen, actually. A fair few. Make them look spikier. How do I push the other ones back? So that they don't look the same. I think what we do... Where are they? Where are my spikes? Okay. Put a thing on top. Multiply. Is multiply the move? Is this the right color? Hmm. Eraser. I think that looks all right. This is like way more 3D than anything else in this drawing, which has me concerned. But we'll see. This side of this box is not it. What does the side of the box look like? It's like almost a purple. Um, hang on a second. Gonna merge all these together. Put the purple on there. Whoops. That's looking better. I'm gonna add the purple. This is. Okay. Over here as well. And then we make it look all rusty and blood and all that. How do I do that? Uh, grab a good old dry blood color. I wish I had better brushes, but I'm so lazy to download. Okay. 
feel like going with the downward motions is a good idea. Go with the direction that it's going in, you know? Um, yeah. Oh, it's good to me. Okay. I'm going to... Delete this. Merge. All of these. Oh, but I'll regret that later. And then we're going to... Do this for my own sake. There we go. <laughs> I'll change the the scrapings on it. Oops. Cover some of that up. No, just make it look a little different. Yeah. Actually, hang on. This light source doesn't make sense anymore. I guess it does a little bit, but... I don't like it. So I'm covering it. I think that's good. I like it. Now the, the inner box. There's like a... There's like a piece in the front. Just came back. How are y'all? How are y'all doing? We're doing good. We be. We're working on the box. Uh, let's see here. Actually, I've got. That's a good picture of it. Why does that almost look painted? Um, it's a little lower down, huh? Like this. And then a little bit wider. Oops. I've got mine at a different angle than what it actually is. Darker, uh, let's tool drop, keep things consistent. Right. Why is this difficult? Uh, good enough. Okay. <laughs> Right? 
That's a little dark looking, but... Ah! Oh, was I drawing? I'm the wrong way? No, up here. I get lost. I already have so many layers. There we go. Right. And then I'm gonna... Go back here. I'm gonna outline this a little bit. Oh, I'm drawing on the wrong layer again. Just a little bit of an outline. This way it looks a little more cartoony as well, which will help with, you know, the rest of the drawing. And then we'll take this color. There we go. Uh, it looks like he's glowing. I don't like that. There we go. I'm so worried that it looks weirdly 3D compared to the rest. Oops. I might go back and add like outlines on everything and maybe that'll help. Why is this not working? Oh. Wrong brush. I think outlines help a lot. Is it rusty on the front too? Oops, wrong layer. Yeah, you do be rusty. That is so cool, thank you. It's coming along. I'm definitely having some struggles with this box. Put it on a separate layer. What you think of Generation Loss? I really enjoyed it. I was really confused by the tone in the first episode, but I think it like really came together. It was very cool. Box. Okay. I'm gonna go back and add outlines because it's gonna bother me. Uh, yeah, 
get over him? Box, yes. This cursed box for so many reasons. Pretend that I drew this box before I colored it. Pretend I had a plan while drawing it. Using too thick of a pen, I think. It'll be fine once you're zoomed out. You can't even see how messy it is. It's also pretty. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. I try to make it pretty. Are these outlines helping? Do we reckon? Sometimes I really wish my style was more like, um, anime because i like consume a lot of that art style and then i look at it and i'm like mm, my art doesn't look like that but then other times i want it to look more cartoony i don't know i don't know if any artist is always satisfied with their art style but it always means a lot when people say they like it I think it's helping. The outlines. I hear your eyes and I see those brows. I hear those eyes and I see those I'll just have to do somewhat detailed shading. Which is not what my plan was, so I don't know, we'll see. I think it's amazing art progresses with time, you'll make progress. I can tell you it's already great though. Oh, thank you very much, I appreciate that. I'm working on it. Would it be cheating for me to simply Oops. Oops. Hello. Take that and then put it on here. I don't think that's cheating. <laughs> and then we need the outline on this guy.
That looks good. And then there was like the little things holding it together. Was there a top on the box here? No. Add the rust and the blood. I've never drawn an object with this much detail. <laughs> I'll do that on a separate layer, actually. I always forget to make extra layers, and then I regret it, so... everything actually I like the way that looks you don't want me asking how did you learn anatomy I've been trying to get better with my art and can't draw full body pictures for the life of me. Um, how did I learn it? I feel like I still don't know anatomy. A lot of it was just watching like speed paint videos and like trying to take notes on how they do it. <laughs> and also um, like looking up references while I draw and like staring at other people's studies. I should do more studies, but I don't. And then I guess just practice. These are probably not very helpful tips, but I honestly don't know how I, I just kind of, kind of did it. I still don't really know what I'm doing though. But I think watching other people draw has helped me a lot. So perhaps that will help you. I've lost my other box. Here it is. No any advice is helpful? Okay, I'm glad. I hope that's helpful. One of the artists that helped, um, or that I used to watch a lot, uh, that influenced my art and like anatomy was uh, Drawing with Waffles. She does like a lot of real-time drawing videos. And I found those quite helpful. Do I draw dry blood on the spikes too? The answer is yes. I 
Oh, you love drawing Hollow? Yeah, her art's so nice. I used to watch her like all the time, but I haven't in a while, unfortunately. I don't really know why. She still uploads. <laughs> Blood spikes, yippee. Looks amazing, love your art style. Oh, thank you very much, I'm glad. We're on blood to some spikes, as one does. That's the front bar, where did I put it? There we go. Over here. I'm taking some creative liberties with this because uh, I want to draw the blood. <laughs> I don't think it's on this part of the thing though. Or rest, whichever you want to interpret it as. There we go. Oh wait, the outside of the other box. Where is the other box? Here it is. There, I think that looks pretty good. I'm gonna group some stuff so that I don't get confused. This is all box. Right? Box. And then, uh... That's liner. Right? That's box. This box, that's box. Oops. Wait, were you a box? Yes. Oh, this is more box. Box two, okay. I don't wanna get confused. <laughs> Shading time. What color do I shade in? I think... Hmm... Just this color might be good, honestly. My go-to to start shading is always the neck. <laughs> this I am worried my usual style will not accommodate the box I have just created <laughs> We'll see. Oops. I'm gonna shade all of that in. Where is this light coming from? I'm gonna use this as the main reference. It's very straight on, so I'm gonna just change lighting. Which episode was your favorite from the three? I think the last one was my favorite. There was some really cool moments in that one. And I liked the, like, tone of that one. But the uh, second one and the first one were also really good. The second one was fun because there were so many people in it. And the first one was fun just because the set was really cool and uh, Charlie and Sneak are very funny. Hmm. 
Hmm. Everyone's acting so right. They were so good. I was especially surprised by Rambo. I'm not really sure why I was surprised, but that last scene was crazy. It was really good. I think it's just because I already knew that, like, um, like Charlie and Sneak are good at acting from the other stuff they've done. But I don't think we've ever seen Rambu act. I guess other than like Dreamus and Pilor, but it was very cool. The last scene, the screams come here, right? I was like, oh my goodness. I felt bad. <laughs> Did you vote for him to, to live or die? I didn't vote because I'm a lurker. And I was too anxious. <laughs> but... I'm curious what you voted. Should I do the light coming from the outsides? Hmm. It started with then changed to die at the end, yeah. That makes sense. I was really kind of wanting it to be a tie. But I don't know if you saw his stream explaining what would have happened if it was a tie, but it, it would have just been the death anyway. <laughs> I voted die, it seems so bad letting them live. In a messed up world like that? Yeah. And they were like... Asking <laughs> for it, but... I still felt bad. I was kind of hoping live a little bit at the beginning, cause... I thought maybe that would be like, give them another chance to figure out what's going on, maybe? And to like, eventually get out? But then... I don't know. The moral dilemma. Don't want them to suffer, but like... I would like them to live. <laughs> I'm so bad at shedding hair, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> about it says... Oh, um, I wanted the 50-50 as well, but it was basically impossible. Yeah, it was. It was like close to 50-50, but then there would have been stragglers. Hmm, there's like a... Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'll add like overlay colors afterwards. Contrast shading looks better. Box. Shade box. How do I- I made everything painterly and now I'm regretting it. Cause how do I make- I don't like painting characters. <laughs> Fancy harsh lighting though, that's fun. I haven't done fancy lighting in a drawing in years. But I used to do it all the time, it was like my signature thing. How do we... This is 
this make sense? Box. It's weird to do above head lighting. Oops. I do not wish to crop it. I think those hands look instantly better with shading. Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> how do we want to do this part? I think this makes sense. It's all being bunched into this spot, so. And then it goes out this way. Yeah, that looks good, okay. Me just weighing all the clothing folds. <laughs> I just saw the notif and I have to go to sleep sadly, but this looks amazing and you're doing a great job. Hope you have a good soon. Thank you. I hope you have a good sleep. Thanks for stopping by. I think the shading's turning out pretty good. I'm happy with this so far. Hmm, legs though. Didn't think about that. Forgot legs exist. This looks all right, all right. And then the other leg. I'm color that in. I feel like up here looks bare. With myself that leaves a mess inside my head. Oh shit, I'm doing it again. Repelling any potential friend, revealing my innate ability to never Does this make sense. But in the end, I still pretend because then we won't polite enough to choose to misspend. I don't want the bags, the jeans to be too baggy. Training people with my boring stories and opinions to see the bigger picture takes intelligence and wisdom, but I won't see nothing with just myself in my vision. This part of the song is not my favorite part. <laughs> Sir. You have to <laughs> It's a good- I really like uh, his like guitar acoustic cover of it, but it's not on Spotify. Intense tendency to dwell, seeding open this connection, affected by my perception that I'm not entered. 
They just start wailing. Yeah, they do. It's a little bit uncomfortable, TBH. Oh, I forgot that shoes exist and they need shaded as well. Shoes. There we go, okay. <laughs> I feel like this kind of looks a little bit painterly. I'm a little more feeling better about it. So, heard <laughs> that shoes exist. Relatable TVH. Yeah, I used to walk around the street without shoes on when I was 14. I'm just not very smart. How do you shade hair? I just... I just don't know. Something I gotta work on. Okay. Let's do an overlay layer underneath. In this, you just go through the floor. That's how to shade hair. Yeah, I feel like sometimes the hair I draw confuses me and I don't know the flow. Because there's so many, like, loose strands. Is red the color I want to be shading with? I don't think so. Um, let's do a purple-y color? No. A pinkish color? Yeah, pink. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like the pink on the white. I don't know why. I think I need a thicker. Oh, I don't like that. Hmm. Eraser. Yeah, I don't know why the pink looks really weird there, but it does. Hmm. Let's see. I think another shading color will be good. On overlay. Maybe we do blue this time. No. Maybe I'll, I've never shaded with yellow before because it looks muddy. Right. I mean, that's not the worst thing I've ever seen. If I lower the opacity. Is 
Is that muddy looking? Hmm. I think it's fine. It's fine. I've decided it's fine. This I wanna. Okay. Maybe like a highlight color could be good. Could be kind of fun and fresh. And that I'm willing to use yellow. If yellow will behave. Hmm, maybe yellow's not behaving. No, it is. It's fine. Makes the hair shiny. Subtle yellow. I think it makes a difference. What if, dare I say, I do a whole layer on top on multiply and then erase? Erase the edges and stuff. It's an the light source is coming from the top. making hmm noises helps me figure it out apparently lower opacity a bit did that improve it or make it worse oh i think it improved it it's a little bit harsh though but i like it on the face so i'm just gonna just gonna lightly erase everywhere Yeah, I think that helped. That's why it makes it look so cool. Thanks. I'm, I'm hoping it looks a little more 3D looking. Makes him pop more. I did notice there is light reflection in the mask, so I'm going to do that next. And I'll add it elsewhere for fun. Doing backgrounds means like all these extra things to think about with lighting. <laughs> like light reflections. So 
a little bit in the hair. There we go. I think that looks good. I'm going to fix the eyes. Make, make them stand out a bit more. Oh, that's a little too dark. What color are Rambo's eyes? Are they just brown? What is that eye color? Is it blue? I've never looked into their eyes long enough to figure out the color. <laughs> I feel like they, it's blue, right? Blue or brown? Or gray? Gray? Gray bluish? Okay. Maybe it's just hazel. Oh no. Wait, why does it look like that? I messed something up. Wait, that looks good from afar, I think, the blue. Because it makes the jeans, it, it's all more cohesive. So if they don't have blue eyes, they do now. I've decided. Clean that up a bit. And then we do a little cheeky highlight. I want like a bright red highlight as well. There's definitely a bluish gray. Yeah, I think so. Look at pictures to make sure. It's hard to tell because their face cam's usually pretty small. Let's add some hair highlights. Agar, agar the color. <laughs> That's too bright. I don't want their hair to look like a wig. I've been doing highlights with these like pen strokes lately instead of little dots that I usually do I think it makes the hair look more textured soften the edges That looks good, I think. I'm gonna do some, uh... Some bonus hair strands. Hmm. Basically just go with what feels the most right for you when coloring the eyes. That's true. It's just what it's real people. I like to try, but then sometimes it's hard to tell. I want their hair to look messy because they've just been through a whole ordeal. But not so messy that it looks weird from afar. Sometimes I overdo it with the hair strands and then it looks really weird once I zoom out.
Let's see, is that good? Hmm. I think this is good. I'm proud of the fact that I feel like the face looks like him. Even though there's not much of it showing. <laughs> Wanna add a... Some little eye bags, cause the poor lad is tired. I also want to add tears. I feel bad, but I think it's necessary. You must cry. Cause what I saw it, aren't we all? It's so true. Mission loss run has been through some stuff, man. Yes. Very intense. But they're no longer suffering. <laughs> I'm so sorry, too soon. Hang on, I want to make the tears like building up in this part of the mask. Make it a little more subtle, like tear stained almost. That looks pretty alright, I think. Maybe I'll add a little bit of shine on the mask. Okay, well, first of all. Mr. Beast paying for everyone's therapy, honestly. <laughs> Might be necessary now. Between generation loss and the QSMP, how are we surviving? I'm gonna save this just in case. <laughs> hmm. This is looking pretty, like, better than I thought it would look, to be honest. You know what? You know what they need? First of all, they need to be grouped. Ron Boo. Wow, this is great. Thank you. It's come a long way since the beginning of stream. I'm going to give them a shadow now. It's time. They deserve it. They've earned their shadow. There you go, pal. I can see the floor is really reflective, so it goes really f down. I've 
totally been through a shadow. It's their prize, the grand prize. Uh, there's a layer there. Oh, I had this on the whole time and it was making it look weird. This is what it actually looks like. Hmm, I kind of liked it better before. <laughs> what does that say? Uh, that says that I should add a layer of pinkish white on top and lower the opacity. Yeah, that's better. Is it better? Hang on. Shadow is all we need in life. <laughs> yes. It's the ultimate thing you can win in life is to have a shadow. And sometimes you ever have you ever have two shadows from the sun? That's extra special. <laughs> yeah, I think the pink is necessary to separate him from the background a bit. And it makes the lights in the background look more like they glow, if that makes sense. I think it helps. Two shadows, what could we want more? I know, right? It's the best gift in life. Two shadows. But uh, Rambo only gets one shadow, sorry. I think the next step is uh, doing the faces in the TV. Maybe, hmm, do I want to do that right now? Hang on. I regret what I've done with these TVs. Um, I wish I waited to set them up. Ah! What did I do? Why is that happening? Hello? Oh. TV screens. It's all like, all right. How do I, uh, hmm. It's fine if it's not fully even around the whole thing, right? What do your TVs look like? Oh, there's like different kinds of monitors. Gotta make some TV screens. I'm just gonna make all my TV screens pretty much the same. For my own convenience. Do you think it'll be too much 
to have all the other characters in the TVs. Is that going to be too distracting? Or should I leave it as like glitchy TVs? Just sneakily putting Splish up on one of the TVs, that would be really funny. I feel like it would be noticeable. My original idea was to do it like it's um like a movie poster that features all the characters and then like have their names under it to like you know, like like a like a poster. But now I'm a little unsure if you make some of them have characters or blurring them out a little. Yeah, I could do that. Because I don't want it to be too noticeable. So this is a wider screen. We'll see. I'll draw the faces. I don't know if I'm going to draw the faces today. It's tempting, but I don't know. Will you be posting this somewhere when it's done? Yeah, I'll post it on my... I mean, Twitter will probably be the best place to see it, but I'm posting it on Instagram and Tumblr as well. But I feel like Twitter usually has the best quality uh, images. I guess Tumblr does too, but I don't know. Not many people are on Tumblr. <laughs> But I've been on Tumblr since like 2016 and I can't give up on it now. Oh, do I have a full box for this? Let's go have a great. I've had great fun watching this stream and we'll definitely be coming back around. Have fun. Oh, thank you very much for stopping by. I had fun chatting. I appreciate it. It doesn't have much quality in its users, though. That's true. Twitter's bad in different ways. Oops. But, like, uh,. In terms of image quality of the posts compared to like Instagram, Twitter's way better. But like Twitter is impossible to grow on as an artist, it's so annoying. Twitter exists for people who already have a following to talk to their following. You can't grow on Twitter in my experience. What is the song? I don't know it. Spotify has reached the point where it's just shuffling through songs I think I like. Oh, 
I guess it can let it play. It doesn't sound too bad. What? I need my box. Image quality, yeah. Instagram's so bad for that. They like the quality decreases so much. And their like formatting's really bad. I'm not a big Instagram fan, but I'll keep using it. One more TV. There we go. Televisions. Maybe I can draw the rope for now on his arms. What's this? I have this random group with nothing in it. Put all these together. TV. <laughs> it looks so weird without it. The wires look silly. Um. Okay, I'm just going to take, is it rope or is it chains? It's rope, right? It's so small I can't tell. Oh wait. Is that a bike walk? No, it's a wire. It's cable. It's rope. Okay. Oh, but then there's chains there. I'm just gonna go with rope. Feels right. So I'm just gonna do it like this. The jacket's getting in the way. And then I'll take the outline. Just pretend that I drew this originally. That looks really loose, but it's fine. Top for shading. Multiply. Oh, that's really dark. Oh, that's all right. There we go. That looks good. 
And then I'll go into the background layer over here. And I'll just draw the ropes back here as if tied to this thing. Hopefully. Hmm, that looks great. Uh <laughs> I think I just need to do it thinner. And then lower opacity, perhaps? Hopefully that gets it across. I don't want it to look like, I don't know. I don't want it to seem like he's tied to literally nothing and just standing there. So that's kind of awkward. I think that helps. Hopefully. Yeah. I think I'm going to end it there for now and continue drawing this. Perhaps tomorrow I could stream it again. Um, so yeah, that's that's it. Thank you for watching the progress so far. Uh, and thanks for chatting. I appreciate it. Uh, I'm going to pause. Or I don't need to pause the song. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thank you for coming. I hope you enjoy stream. Uh, I had fun. Yes, yes. Okay. Bye-bye. Looks really cool so far. Thank you. I'm about to end up. Bye. Bye, everybody.